Get your paper and your pencil and pay close attention to Kay's recipe for today. It's going to be nutritious and mm-mm, Kay's making it the Cajun way. Let Kay occasionize your meal. Let Kay occasionize your meal. Make time every day to cook with Kay. Let Kay occasionize your meal. Welcome back to Cook with Kay. Today I'm going to make my first batch nail sauce inside of some macaroni and I'm going to bring it to the family gathering. I'm learning to make this sauce from Mr. Shane Renee. His YouTube channel is Shane Renee's Acadiana Kitchen. This is his macaroni and cheese the recipe I'm trying. First thing we did was we diced the onion, some celery, and some bell pepper which is the Cajun Trinity, and we diced our ham that we're going to brown next. Here's a tip. When you know it's hot enough, you just put a little piece of ham, and when it starts to sizzle, that's when you know it's hot enough. I hear a sizzle, so I'm going to add the olive oil and put some ham. Well, that's brown and good. We're gonna grate some cheese for the topping. Now we're gonna add our Cajun Trinity in. If you find a little dry, you can add olive oil. This cooked down, so we're gonna add a tablespoon of garlic. Mix it. And then half a cup of brown sugar. Mix it. We're gonna season it with some cracked black pepper. We're going to cover it and set it to the side. Now we're going to go to the bechamel sauce. We're going to add about a stick and a half of butter. Now we're going to add a cup of all-purpose flour since it melted. We're making kind of like a roux here. Here's a tip. You don't want to brown it. You want to just get the flour taste out. I've been stirring this for about five minutes. So I'm going to add a little bit of milk at a time to get incorporated with the flour. You want to put about three quarts of milk. <laughs> this is a lot of work. We put these in two pans and we use the shells just like Chef Shane said. Now we're going to add some medium cheddar and some pepper jack cheese. We saved a fourth to, to shred for our topping. And by the way, it was a pound of each cheese. Keep stirring so you don't burn the bottom. We're going to add our cream cheese in so that can all get happy together. I'm 
I'm gonna preheat my oven to 375. This is looking good. Now we're gonna sprinkle in a little Parmesan. Now we're just gonna add our salt and pepper. My sauce looks done, it looks smooth, so we're gonna ladle it on my pasta. I'm gonna put half of my sh brown sugar glazed ham, because since I have two pans. Now I'm mixing it in. Now we're gonna add more sauce. Okay, I chopped up my tortilla chips inside the mini food processor with the cheese that I used. So that we're gonna use that as a topping. Now I'm gonna sprinkle on my own smoky seasoning rub. Now we're gonna cover it with foil. We're gonna bake it for half an hour, covered, and then we're gonna bake it for another 15 minutes, but we're gonna take the foil off. Okay, this is done, and I have to say, this is delicious. Mmm, mmm! Awesome.